All right. Um, up in here on the forehead, I think right here we can get rid of that indent. Um, actually, we could probably get rid of it right here. So these three vertices should be moved back. Remember I moved them earlier when I first created that profile? Well, I think now it's time to move them back. Let's go here. Pull you out a little bit. Here. Pull you out a little bit. Um, let's click on this guy. Come in the side view. And we'll line him up even with that profile. Come here. Come here. Here. Yeah, see, maybe I shouldn't have moved all of those guys. So, let's put them all back. Didn't really need to create that curvature right away, huh? Here. I think I'll take these guys. Let's not ignore back facing. I don't know if I'm going to like that dent in his head. So I'll make that a little smoother there. I'm come here. Make you a little bit smoother. Uh, maybe more. Okay. Alright. Let's come back here. And let's continue right along extruding our edges straight across the whole model here um, I think now I'm going to do a target weld one target weld you Actually, let's move you down a little bit. Like this. Let's see if that messed anything up. No. We'll mess with his head. Is the shape of his head. Like the, all these vertices need to be adjusted a little bit. Add a little more curvature in that area. See how they're all so flat? I don't know. We'll see how Turbo Smooth handles it. And if we don't like it, we shall fix it manually. Have this edge. Move this edge out to here. And then we'll come here. Bit. Number one, come here, click weld, number change, yes. Okay. Over here. I wonder, hmm. let me see something. Control click this guy. Is that it as far as who's up here? I think so. I think if I come here, yep, there's only two edges left. I'm going to try some. See if I can save myself a little bit of time. I don't want to take a shortcut that's going to end up screwing me up. But if I do it the way I'm doing this here, it'll probably work out well. Come there. Let's go with one. Come here. going on there? Why does it look like we have way too many 
we do. Um, so I click weld, and I come here, and I click weld. Okay. It seemed to work out okay. Two. Windows crossing. Change that. I want to try something different here. I'm going to try picking all those edges. I'm going to try picking all these edges. And then, let's go shift here. And then, shift down. What the hell? Oh, darn it, I did it again. When I clicked him down here, I was holding shift. It's just a bad habit. It's just a bad habit. Sorry. To so there. And there's some weird things happening here. Control Z, Control Z. What happens here? I go. Alright, that's not what I want to do. So from here, let's shift drag. What's happening there? I know what's happening there. One. Let's drag these guys here. There's got to be a weld there. Yep. You've got to do a weld there. Uh, two. Let's go shift drag. Here. One. Come here. And go weld. pretty much straight across for the next bunch, right? Yeah. Alright. Two. Go. Shift drag you. Shift drag you. And then one more. Shift drag you. Actually one more after that. Shift drag you. Now if I go one and I grab all of these guys and I click weld let's go OK all of you guys should be welded now now we're going to get tricky I'm going to go here Shift drag you out to here. Now we're going to come here. And we're going to have to. Uh oh. We didn't even get one run done. Alright, I still have a minute. So we'll move you there. And then we're going to go. One. Come here. Click weld. And I'm going to go two. Shift here. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! I'm going to come here. Move you back here. Then we're going to move you down. Then we're going to go one. Click and drag around here. And click on weld. And you didn't weld. Up the threshold. Now you snap. Okay. Now, we'll fix that curvature after I gotta end the video.